Dave, this is a kind of a funny question, but could you tell me your most painful race experience ever? Painful? Well, I've had a whole bucket of them. Uh, <laughs> I don't know if it's that funny, Andrew. I mean, what's so funny about that? Uh, what's the most painful race experience? Oh, wow. I, I think one of, one of the races that always uh, kind of knocked me mentally is uh, I was in the lead in Nice and uh, Mark dominated that race. He won it 10 times. And uh, I had the lead on the bike and I got a flat tire and I, and I wasn't prepared to put on a, try to roll on a tire on that real curvy course. So that one kind of, uh, that was painful mentally and emotionally. And I think it's the travel and the preparation and the prestige of that race at the time I was uh, racing. It was really Hawaii and Nice. So, you know, losing, losing that one or having just drop out and sit in a car was, was difficult. I mean, I've had a number of, of races where I was just completely off, um, small Olympic and distance race. And I had the flu the day before. I remember shaking and I was cold and I tried to do the race. And I said, Oh, I feel okay. About 10 minutes before. And I just was decimated. Uh, I don't know. I, you know, I, I, I've said this to athletes before and I, and I get this in the big races in, in coaching athletes and, and someone's well-prepared and they're ready to, to knock it out of the park and have a great day. And it, and it doesn't happen. And I always come back to them and say, well, what did you do well in this race? And they're totally befuddled by that question. But if you dissect your race and even a couple of days before nutritionally, how'd you feel? And the morning of and how the first 300 meters of the swim, you start breaking it down into small segments. All of a sudden they say, well, I felt okay there. How about out of the saddle on the bike? Yeah, I felt okay on that. I just a little bit flat in that windy section. All of a sudden they, there, there are fragments of success and, and they look at it like, you know, it wasn't just total failure. And so I always have athletes write those down and um, that's quite helpful. And I didn't really answer your question because I don't have the answer. It's okay. Um, okay, well, thanks. 